Salt fiberglass shingles are some of the most widely used roofing materials in all climates due to the large number of manufacturers, patterns, and a wide variety of colors and textures. The relative low cost, ease of installation, fire resistance, and durability make the asphalt fiberglass shingles a favorite among many contractors. This roof, like the Spanish tile, is installed over top of OSB and tar paper. You can buy asphalt fiberglass roofs that are guaranteed for a lifespan of 20 to 50 years depending on the environment. When inspecting this type of roof, look for dried and worn out sections that seem to be cracking because of exposure. Cupping of the individual shingles, deterioration and brittleness are common signs of age and failure. Also keep in mind that this roof can be installed over top of an existing roof. This should not be a problem unless both roofs together create such unevenness that water does not drain properly. On this roof, the asphalt fiberglass shingles were installed over top of a wooden shake roof. You can tell that there is a lot of unevenness to the overall layout of the asphalt shingles. On this roof, the wooden shingles were nailed down tightly, so the asphalt fiberglass roof lies more evenly. Other items to remember is that the asphalt fiberglass shingle should be installed about three quarters of an inch over the edge of the fascia board to allow water to flow off the edge of the shingle and not run down the front of the fascia board. This roof was not installed three quarters of an inch over the edge of the fascia board, so now water can soak the fascia board and cause dry rot and potential leakage problems in the future. Metal and panel roofs are common in snow areas and provide great protection to the house when large snow loads are present. Given that these roofs have specialty coatings applied and are galvanized, they are not generally susceptible to rust. However, they can become corroded and begin to leak if damaged. Main areas of concern are the joints where the metal roof comes in contact with the house. Make sure that these areas are sealed and appear to be in good condition. Flat roofs are not as common in new home construction as they were in the 1970s. These roofs need to be inspected for any water buildup or puddling. This style of roof must include drains and should drain water proficiently. Check to make sure the roof is in good condition and does not have any cracks or other types of damage in the roof membrane. Here you can see where the roof membrane is separating from the felt underlayment. This can cause the membrane to crack and split, and will become a problem in the future. Make sure the roof vents are flashed properly, and that all found problems are addressed. It is important to pay attention to the condition of your roof, as any problems directly affect the rest of the house. 